Hey, this is Drew. Welcome back to Beyond Seclusion. Today, I am going to review the NAA Pocket Pistol. 22 long rifle, 22 mag. We are at the 15 feet. Let's go up to 5 feet because what I'm reviewing this for is potential for concealed carry. We'll talk more about that. Let's just start off at 5 feet and see what we get. Okay, so here's the 5 feet. Now, you, you can't really tell. I dug it in the snow. We've, we've been having a lot of snow. I had a few preliminary shots here just to kind of test fire. So let's make sure, see where the holes already were. And I'm not going to cheat. I'm going to have the muzzle at five feet. So let's go ahead and pull this out. It clicks into place. And I'm going to fire this one hand even. So there's our line. And we're going five feet. I have noticed it does like to shoot a little low. I'm gonna compensate, but hey, not bad at five feet. So now we're gonna go 10 feet. I think I've got the, the sights figured out here a little bit better. And we are shooting 22 mag. Yeah, I did spread that one out a bit. <laughs> At first, I thought I was putting them all in the same hole. Yeah, wishful thinking. But we've also got a one and a quarter inch barrel. Let's try 15. I haven't practiced with this either, so let's see. You know, maybe with a 22, a little practice, we'll try that way. 15 feet, not cheating here. Muscle's gonna be even with the line once I raise it up. Try to concentrate here a little bit better. That was low. Oh, that was a bullseye. The secret here <laughs> is just a little bit of practice. When I focus on not flinching, the first shot, I put it right in the bullseye, okay? That's not bad. I need a little practice. Let's try one here with both hands at 15 feet. So we're gonna try 15 feet with 22 long rifle. And I'm gonna use both hands here. I wanna see what kind of groups we can get. We're not gonna win any marksmanship competition with this gun, but at 15 feet, that's not bad. I mean, that's hitting, that's hitting palm size. I'm, I'm okay with that. Okay, we're at 15 feet here. Let's just see how fast I can hit that. Not bad. Let's try a little spinner here at 15 yards. I did say 15 yards, but sorry. That was 15 feet. All right. Let's just see what this baby looks like. Cats are going to be happy. And I heard this ham has gone bad, so hopefully... Got nothing coming out the back. Let's just try doing a slice here. Ooh, got some nasty. Whoa, I didn't cut that.
That goes in a ways. That's just all turned to mush. Let's try uh, All right, so here's 22 mag shot. Let's just start slicing off here. Pretty good. There's some fragments from the 22. Wow, that made it almost all the way through to the other side. That's still our 22 mag there. <laughs> 22 mag still going. Here's here's shrapnel. And this is from the back side. So we came all the way through from the front. There's more shrapnel. There's one of our 22 mags. I think, nope, that's, that's more 22 long rifle fragments in there. See, they went. I mean, that just made a mess in the middle of that ham. Okay, so real quick here. Let's take a look at this right out of the box. So as you see here, it comes in a nice little box. And I didn't know this, but it, it came with a lock box, which is, you know, great. That's just an added bonus. Open it up, and we've got the two cylinders. That's the 22 long rifle cylinder. It has the 22 mag cylinder in it. I got to say, the grip was way more impressive than I thought. And then it looks on the video... It's actually comfortable. Um, you just, I, I, I didn't think it would be. It's got these two little buttons here that we can push on and that's what then closes it. You gotta push both sides and it folds up. You can't even tell this is in your pocket. Underneath, don't forget underneath here, we've got our keys, we've got the paperwork, we've got our warranty, it's got uh, the little Allen wrenches here for, I believe, adjusting the tension on the handle. This is how we take out the cylinder. Okay, This is not going to be a quick change, quick reload weapon by any stretch of the word. It's going to take you um, a couple of minutes at, at the very least. So, you got five shots. Um, it's it's going to take you several minutes. Even if you've got a loaded cylinder in your pocket, it's not going to be terribly fast. It's going to take you at least probably 30 seconds with practice. Now, it does have a really unique safety feature here. We can see these little, we can see these little lines right there. That's a safety groove. And we turn it in and I pull the trigger, pull the trigger, and we can get that hammer to go forward and this is how it should look this is this is the safety now i get it in that groove and it's not a safety as in i can't pull the hammer back and fire but as soon as i do pull it back it's ready to go with the handle folded the trigger's covered so anyway you get it in that position and in your pocket i really don't think there's any possibility of this going off even hitting the hammer because that's what that safety notch is for it can't fire because it's not sitting on a round and as long as this is folded up i can't pull the trigger so even if i cock it there's no way to get that to go off so what's the bottom line here with this little naa north american arms mini pocket revolver. I'm giving it 
two thumbs up. Five stars. I love this little gun. It's not going to win an accuracy competition, but as you can see, it's more than adequate for hitting what you need to uh, at 15 feet. And if you've got your concealed carry, you know that that's the farthest that you go, that most shootings, self-defense happen 15 feet and under. The size of this, and you know, as time was going on, I, I haven't even run, I've maybe run about 50 rounds through it. I was getting a whole lot better. Okay, a little bit of practice, and the fun thing with this is, you know, it just fits up in your pocket, and plinking and practice is cheap. I mean, every time I was pulling the trigger, it was costing me two cents with that 22 long rifle. Now, the 22 mag gets a little bit more expensive, but, uh, you know, anyway, that's the North American Arms 22 mini revolver. Thanks for watching. Uh, if you've got a product you'd like us to review, please get a hold of us. Be safe. Happy shooting.